Hi, and welcome to another Sealed in Time production, where we bring historical photos to life. Please consider leaving a like and a comment, letting us know which photo is your favorite. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell to be notified whenever a new video is posted. Thanks for watching, and as always, enjoy the show. This 1920s photo captures Mabel Normand, the versatile American silent film actress, director, and screenwriter who was born in New Brighton, New York in November 1893. Morris Engel, born in April 1918 in Brooklyn, New York City, captured this iconic Coney Island photo in 1938. Beyond photography, he made a mark as a director and writer, notably recognized for his work on the 1953 film Little Fugitive. The photographer Keyes Scherer paused by the River Seine on a misty morning in Paris, France in 1955, where the water levels were slightly elevated. The 1966 photograph was taken by Wingate Payne, who titled it Mirror of Venus. Photographer Neil Libert immortalized this evening scene within the bustling Grand Central Station of 1960s New York City. Ian Burry's lens immortalized Würzburg, Germany, nestled along the picturesque banks of the main river in Lower Franconia, located in the northern reaches of Bavaria. This captivating photograph dates back to 1959. Photographer Yevgeny Kassin skillfully captured the charm of these elegant women who were leisurely walking through the 1960s town when they were enveloped by a downpour. A photograph from 1933, captured by the photographer Pierre Janet, showcases Belle Ile en Mer, France. This island, situated off the coast of Brittany, in the Morbihan department, stands as the largest among Brittany's islands. In a 1910 photograph, Mina C. Van Winkle, a suffragist from Newark, New Jersey, stands proudly at the bow of a tugboat, holding a torch aloft. The renowned American actress of both silver screen and television, Doris Kenyon, depicted in this image, embarked on her cinematic journey in 1915 with her debut film, The Rack, produced by the World Film Company of Fort Lee, New Jersey. In June of 1922, the polo matches took place with the hillsides conveniently overlooking the field, offering a splendid opportunity to enjoy a complimentary spectacle while indulging in a leisurely picnic. During one of the air raids of World War II, certain Londoners sought refuge on an underground escalator for shelter. The delighted pair readies themselves for a jaunt in their fresh Hupmobile, starting off from their residence situated at the intersection of Old Common and Bolton Station Road in Lancaster, Massachusetts. A youth provides transportation for his neighbors and friends, acting as the engine by physically pushing his car. In 1935, in Reedsville, West Virginia, three brothers were busy clearing brush from a pumpkin patch, 
the youngest brother had the task of sitting on the brush to prevent it from spilling out of the wheelbarrow. Women are stationed in a foundry assembly zone, diligently affixing the outer bands onto the 1914 anti-personnel artillery munitions known as shrapnel shells. Beverly Bayard and Laureen Davis embarked on a journey to Cuba by bicycle following their 1920 cross-country trek from San Francisco to New York. Yul Brenner, a Russian-born actor, gained his greatest fame through his depiction of King Mong Kut in the beloved Rodgers and Hammerstein musical, The King and I. In the brisk early spring of 1905, nestled along the bustling boardwalk of Atlantic City, New Jersey, stood the majestic St. Charles Hotel. A father is flying his daughter in his newest airplane model to a unique event in 1934. Each brick was meticulously laid by hand, seamlessly interlocking with its neighbors before being firmly pressed into the bustling thoroughfares of Paris, France in the year 1899. In 1877, the bustling streets of London's Covent Garden were a vibrant haven for flower sellers where they joyfully passed each day. However, Today, their spirits are weighed down by the somber news of a child's passing. In 1877, the bustling streets of London's Covent Garden were a vibrant haven for flower sellers, where they joyfully passed each day. However, today, their spirits are weighed down by the somber news of a child's passing. Arthur Young used the backyard of his 1941 Paoli, Pennsylvania residence as the proving ground for his remote-controlled helicopter. Mary Miles Minter, an American actress, graced the screens in 53 silent films starting in 1922. However, the scandal revolving around the demise of William Desmond Taylor led her to bid adieu to her film career in 1923. On a crisp Saturday morning in 1901, Summit, Illinois, a pair of seasoned fishermen are once more dedicated to their craft. A gathering of FSA clients is currently underway at Sabine Farms near Marshall, Texas, where they are attentively heeding the guidance of the farm supervisor. A young woman, poised with her petite driving whip, prepared to urge the team, pulling her wagon into action should they delay any longer. Aunt Charlotte, arrived in town to gather her weekly provisions, taking a moment to catch up with an old friend she chanced upon strolling along the 1899 road. In 1940, Rodney, Mississippi, an ancient jalopy, rests in front of a weathered house. Once a bustling town, Rodney's population dwindled when the Mississippi River altered its course leaving behind a ghostly echo of its former self. Today, this spectral remnant is enshrined on the National Register of Historic Places.